Okay, this is Norwich 93. We're still on the M1 Grand now. We're going to do the rear hand guard. This is the hand guard that usually gets stuck and nobody wants to take it off because it's such a pain to remove it and clean underneath or clean in the areas if it rattles and you want to change it out. So we have the rear hand guard clip and a pair of special pliers made by the CMP and they will install and remove the rear hand guard. This is basically a spring it is offset this is the low side this is the high side well likewise with the tool if you look really close one side's the high side one side's the low side so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to mount it we make sure that we have our rear hand guard same thing low side high side what i like to do is just hook it and then hold it with my thumb and then I'm going to make sure that my tool is orientated the same way and I'm going to try to get this in the camera as best as I can but what I'm doing is I'm catching the lip here on the spring and then I'm going to catch it on the far side there it's kind of hard to do with a camera in the way okay now I got it. Apply a little bit of pressure. Sorry, you guys can't see. Flip it around. A little bit of pressure. And I'm just holding the back side of the spring with my finger. And I'm gently pushing up. I'm also holding the handguard right here. And I'm opening my pliers. And I'm twisting the top over here. It's getting closer to the wood. Getting right to that edge there. And I'm right there. And of course, she wants to get stuck. You can see how close it is right now. I'm right on that edge. I have to open it up a little bit more. And I'm coming up around the corner. Got it over the lip. Slowly let go. Now I put it on without too much, a little bit of wood came off, not that bad. But as far as marring on the outside, there was none, okay? If you have a new handguard or you're cleaning the one that you have in there, now you can clean it out, clean out the, the ridge areas. But if you have it removed and you want to replace it with say something like a grooved, or just a new one, maybe this one's all rusty because it's been sitting there like we just talked about. To remove it basically is going to be the same exact way. Make sure you have the low side, high side done properly. You hook it. I'll flip this around for you. And do the same exact procedure. you're lined up and you're not going to catch the edges for this one I'm actually pulling the tool and the handguard away from each other just to keep these ridges on the tool from clipping on the wood as best as possible so I'm applying pressure now you can see the spring open up see how it's clearing down the bottom right here as soon as it clears the handguard I can see it's walking underneath and then I'm going to twist the handguard out See that? And then take it out. That's how you remove.